Hello, friend. More Mosin here today. I'm eating Tajin chili and lime peach rings. And I got these at Dollar Store or um, Dollar Tree. I always get confused the name of that business, but um, they're chili and lime peach rings from Snack Club. Established 1984 for best flavor, shake and enjoy. Peach rings, gummy peach ring candy seasoned with Tajin, Classico, lime, chili lime seasoning. And uh, packaged in the USA. And uh, these, I think these have a ton of sugar. I was looking at that yesterday. Yeah, 37 grams of sugar for the whole package. So that's pretty extreme. That's a, too much sugar for me. But I'm going to do it for my art. And let's... Hmm, they smell a little weird. I forgot to shake them up. You want to make sure and get that powder all over them, the chili powder. And here's what one looks like. It's uh, real thick. It's thicker than a peach ring I'm usually used to. But let's try it and see. Hmm. It's a little spicy. I like the chili flavoring. I like the mix of hot and sweet. Of course, I grew up with stuff like this. I grew up in um, a place called Escondido, California, in uh, Southern California. Big Mexican population. We had a lot of Hispanics there. And uh, I grew up going to school with a lot of Hispanic kids and stuff. And me being a fat kid, I always wanted to find out about candy and new candies and stuff. So I'd go in the little Mexican markets. And uh, they had a lot of this chili powder stuff and like suckers that, had, um, that were mango flavored but had chili powder all over the outside. And then there was some candy that was just straight up a little container of chili powder. Or there'd be like little packets that were just salt and lime. And that was supposed to be candy. I, and that was never my favorite. But I did like some of the gummies like these that have gummy, they're gummy candies. But they have the chili lime powder. I'm not crazy about the consistency of the peach ring. It's a little like more firm than I'm used to. A softer, gummier peach ring would have been a little better. I think I'm going to eat four of these on camera because that's considered one serving. And then you're getting 16 grams of sugar which is a lot better than 37. And you don't want to see me just chewing these things for 35 minutes. So here's my third one. You can see the powder and stuff.
and uh, it's really different. Some people wouldn't like it. I probably should have saved these to eat with Andy Cook's food. I think he would have not liked them, which would have been funny and made a great video. Like I say, I grew up with stuff like this. And, and like whenever I do um, trick-or-treating, like at the mall one year, I gave out trick-or-treats as part of my job. And I got some spicy Mexican candy and threw it into the bag. I'd give them a few pieces of normal candy and then a spicy Mexican candy. Just out of my own money, just because I think it's fun on Halloween to get different kinds of candy and try different kinds of candy. All right, so here's my fourth peach ring with chili lime. Yeah, so I love this candy. It reminds me of being a kid growing up in Southern California. If you like spicy candy, I know there's not a whole lot of options, but definitely try this if you like spicy candy. If you like peach rings, try it. And if you're if you're just curious and want to try something different, pick it up at Dollar Tree. It's only a dollar. There's still five peach rings in here, so it's a great value, and it's something different, worth trying. I highly recommend you try it. I'd give them a four out of five, just because I did, the um, texture of the ring wasn't great. The chili powder tasted awesome, and the sweetness of the ring was great. The flavor of the ring was great mixed with the spiciness of the chili lime and uh but the texture of the ring was a little um too firm for me i would have preferred it more gummy and i don't it says best by february 26 2021 so there's plenty of time for it to stay good but you never know, these could have, maybe they're a little older and a little stale, I don't know. There might be fresher ones out there that are a little gummier. But uh, yeah, definitely get them, four out of five, two thumbs up. Uh, they're really awesome, and please thumbs up this video. Please comment if you've tried any of these uh, chili and lime candies and uh, or if you would try them or not and also um, click the bell go ahead and click the bell because I'm gonna do a live stream it's kind of I know people love live streams but they're kind of difficult because a lot of times they get a yellow dollar sign and then I don't get as much ad revenue on them. And also um, today, I did a podcast earlier, a real awesome podcast with one of my good friends I've been friends with for a long time. And the podcast went real well, but when I hung up the phone, then the conversation stuck in my head. So I'm like hearing voices right now. I had to take some of my chill pill meds and stuff. But I didn't feel like doing a live, didn't feel up to it today. But I will be doing more live mukbangs in the future. 
So please click the bell icon so that you can be notified when I go live and catch me live and we can chat back and forth and you can be part of the show and everything. And uh, thanks so much for watching.